Hi everyone, uh, this is the latest acquisition, a little bandsaw. Um, I got sick of setting myself on fire with the grinder, etc. So, um, this is quiet, it's clean, uh, no sparks, um, and you just walk away from it while it's cutting, it's great. The only thing is, um, a little bit banged up on the motor, but that's just cosmetic. They've removed the limit switch for some reason and replaced the original switch assembly with this giant clunky useless unnecessary thing that's obviously designed for a big industrial sort of application so that's going to go it's going to be replaced with little switch assembly one of those self energizing things one of these proximity switches I got from eBay they're brilliant you can adjust the angle you can adjust the length um, they're obviously designed with industrial sort of applications in mind so they're, they're reasonably sealed so you know um, it's better than uh, what I had the first modification I ever put in my lathe was uh, just that little micro switch there so that with this cover I made um, on this lathe um, in America they call it the G0602 here it's the workman um, it's just the safety guard that it, I knocked up with some leftover 3 mil steel and some acrylic um, and I built it high to give clearance and there's a, a big lip there so that if I do leave things on there which I like to do they can't fall in while I'm working um, but I'm going to redo this anyway at some point um, with a huge lump of acrylic which is that and I've got more to put a shelf on the uh, lip on the side like that one there I think it'll just look better it'll probably get really grubby and really dirty really quickly anyway can't for the life of me clean the grease off that um, but yeah anyway it's another project and uh, yeah anyway back to this the uh, sealed jiffy box from jcar electronics it's nice and solid it's got a gasket with it um, brass um, threaded sleeves and flanges so that's what I'm gonna do okay there it is um, again I haven't tightened it, tidied the wiring up yet uh, it wasn't as straightforward as I thought only because I bought a case that was a bit small so and it came with all these little ribs and standoffs and stuff inside to make life easier and to spend half my time grinding those out to make everything fit because that switch is quite deep um, but anyway tidy up the cables at some point but it works great it's just Oh, edit that. Right, so let's see how this thing works. Basically, start it. Beautiful. They're lovely switches. They've got a lot of adjustment in them. Both. Hang on, let's raise this. They've got a lot of adjustment in terms of the length of the arm. Plus, uh, you can change the position of the arm itself. It's got a splined shaft and a little lock nut, and all you do is put it where you want it. Um, works in both directions. 
and it's got two pairs of contacts one pair normally open one pair normally closed um, rubber shield for where the cable goes in it's really good can't remember what they cost me but they're not expensive and they're all over eBay anyway thanks for watching